Hello everyone, welcome once again to our uh, discussion for today. So this time we are going to focus our discussion on one of the applications of uh, differential calculus. So specifically we will talk about uh, optimization problems. So we have here the topic maxima and minima. Okay, so here we have the uh, objectives. At the end of the period, you should be able to solve maxima and minima problems. Alright, so we have only one objective here, just to solve for maxima and minima problems. Alright, so before we go to the uh, solution to maxima and mini problems, minima problems, so let us have here the procedure first now on how to do it. So we have here the procedure for analyzing optimization problems. So we have to begin by deciding precisely what you want to optimize or what you want to maximize or minimize in the given problem. Then the next is you need to assign names to all variables of interest. So it may help to pick letters that suggest the nature of the quantity such as A uh, for area. If you are talking about uh, something about area, then you can use the variable A or letter A to represent uh, an area. Or if you have the volume, so better to use V you know, to, press, to represent your uh, volume for letter V, V. And if we talk about profit, then better to represent uh, P for profit. All right. And then next, we need to draw a figure. So if appropriate, and find an expression for the quantity to be maximized. Or you find the uh, equation huh, that we need to uh, to use in solving the problem. Then after that, use any equations involving the variables to eliminate all but one variable from the quantity to be optimized. So there are times that when you uh, express uh, something, no? uh, usually we have. Uh, one or two or more variables but uh, to help us able to solve it uh, easily then we have to express uh, one variable in terms of the other no? to, to make our expression uh, having one variable only all right and then determine any restrictions on the independent variables use the extreme value theorem as we have discussed in our previous uh, topic no? in the curve stretching we mentioned about extreme value theorem so to optimize the function so there we have to apply the uh, derivative use the concept on the uh, first derivative when you when we have the maximum or the minimum now we have to set the first derivative equal to zero all right, in order for us to be able to get the maximum or the minimum value. Okay, and then we have to interpret the results in terms of appropriate physical, uh, geometric, or economic quantities. All right, now uh, we have here an example. Uh, uh, first example, I will solve only one example class. I will leave to you the, the rest of the exercises. So we have here the first example. A closed box with a square base is to have a volume of 2,000 cubic inch. The material for the top and bottom of the box is to cost 3 cents per square inch. And the material for the sides is to cost 1.5 cents per square inch. And now we are asked to determine the dimension of the box so that the total cost of the material is least. Okay, so this um, keyword here class, uh, least, so that give us the hint 
that this is an optimization problem. Okay, and we have to solve it uh, using the procedure that was presented in the previous slides. All right, so I will solve this class in the other video and uh, hope to see you uh, in the next video uh, solving this problem. Thank you very much. I'll see you soon. Uh, for now, uh, stay safe and healthy always. Bye.